Hi, my name is Jake Kurth. I work with Leeds Forensic Systems. Today I'm going to be discussing a little bit about fluorescence detection and how it works in the laboratory. Fluorescence technique is a contrast increasing technique that allows you to add contrast to samples with little to none themselves. Additionally, because of its mechanism, it can also let you detect samples that are actually below the optical limit of your equipment. A good example are signal mirrors. Signal mirrors are backpacking wilderness survival mirrors that allow a hiker to reflect sunlight directly at a search plane. The way it works is by reflecting sunlight, a large increase in contrast is observed because the sun is being reflected by the hiker to the plane. What also happens is by directly reflecting the sunlight, even if a search plane can't see the hiker herself, they can see the evidence of her being there by the bright light shining at them. It's similar for fluorescence in the laboratory. In crime laboratories, you can use fluorescence detection to add contrast to samples that may not have it, such as semen stains, blood stains, trace evidence, gunshot residue. And the way it would work in this case is really easily shown with an example. Let's say I have the ubiquitous white shirt with semen stains. What I can do is I can shine high energy blue wavelengths of light at the sample. This blue energy hits the sample, but it also hits the shirt. It's reflected back by this white shirt. However, the semen stains that I'm interested in absorb this blue light, cause its electrons to go up to a higher energy state, and when those electrons fall back down, they emit photons of orange light. So what ends up happening is now I have a difference that I can take advantage of with filters. So in summary, blue light in this case hits the sample, the shirt reflects back the blue light, the semen stains emit orange light, and by placing an orange filter either, on, either as goggles or using a spectral imaging system such as the LSV, I can now see that contrast difference from the semen stains and its background. This is fluorescence imaging in a nutshell. Thank you very much. My name is Jake Kurth. I'm with Leeds Forensic Systems.